you may be loading up on more salt than you actually realize. Dr. Mehmet Oz of the Dr. Oz Show shared some ways to cut down on sodium to help you live better now. Dr. Oz, we did a recent story where the USDA re-examined the food pyramid that we're all taught. And what came out of that was that sodium is a big problem for us. Maybe 100,000 lives a year lost because of too much salt in our diets. And you think to yourself, how could that possibly be? Most people do not get the salt in their life because of how they salt their food. It's already in all the products we eat. So let me give you a couple numbers if you don't mind, Rob. Okay. A teaspoonful of salt is the, the amount that you're allowed to have in a day. It's 2,300 milligrams. Now, my advice as a heart surgeon is try to get it down to 1,500 milligrams, especially if you have any risk factors. The number one thing that salt does is cause high blood pressure. And for some people, it's a big issue. But for all of us across the board, we have too much salt in our diet. Okay. Simple example. Diet soda. You might think it's not a big deal, right? Well, Turns out that diet soda has a lot of salt in it. I mean, 35 milligrams or something? Come on, is that a lot? Not, not I a lot. I can have 2,300 a day. You know, most of these things, I'm okay in moderation. <laughs> yeah. But a lot of folks don't drink them in moderation or eat them in moderation. These little uh, pretzels. pretzels here, they're uh -huh. pretty simple, right? This bag of pretzels has enough salt to take you for two days. And I look at it and I go, let's see, we have 300 milligrams of sodium. But I know that if I look at a pre-prepared frozen meal, yeah. woo, baby, or soup, oh yeah. my God. Before soup. you write this off as being benign, it's got 300 milligrams of salt per serving. You know how many servings are in this bag? Yeah, you usually eat three at least. Fifteen. <laughs> Fifteen, three you eat. This is the problem we're talking about. Now, there are things you can do. We have green beans and corn, right? This has literally 20 times more salt per serving than these two cans here. Ah. They otherwise look the same. I'd rather buy the low salt option, add a little bit of the salt. Because you're not going to add a tablespoon. Yeah. You're not going to, naturally. And salt is addictive. It hits parts of our brain like crack cocaine does. We want more of that food. Unfortunately, it's not good for your body.